many things that's held us down But now it looks like things are finally coming around I know we've got a long, long way to go And where we'll end up, I don't know But we won't let nothing hold us back We're putting our shirts together We're polishing up our act And if you've never been held down before I know you refuse to be held down anymore Don't you let nothing, nothing Anita Baker and I'm Vice President for Regents and Affiliates of the National Bar Association. The NBA is so important to me because it is home to some of the greatest and most fearless attorneys in the world. And together, there's nothing we can't achieve. So today, I want to take this time to wish my NBA family a happy holidays and a wonderful new year. I love the NBA. The NBA was there for me when I was looking for my first job out of law school. When I needed a mentor to give me that extra edge in my career, the organization was there. And even as an attorney of color, just having a network of people that look like me that I can fellowship with and learn from. I'm so honored and humbled to be a member of the National Bar Association. Happy holidays from the NBA. What I love about our NBA family is the camaraderie, the love we have for each other, and the genuine desire to see each other succeed. We are invested in each other's futures, and that's what makes our NBA family so special. Happy holidays from the National Bar Association. Happy holidays, NBA family. My name is Onika Williams, and I'm chair of the Young Lawyers Division. This has been a difficult year for all of us, but thanks to your hard work as NBA members, the guidance of our Board of Governors, and the outstanding leadership of Madam President C.K. Hoffler, the NBA has been on the forefront of fighting against the three pandemics affecting our community, COVID-19, police brutality, and voter suppression. This holiday season, I am thankful for my NBA family and the opportunity to serve alongside each and every one of you, wishing you a safe and happy holiday season. See you in 2021. Greetings, NBA family. This year has been a challenging one for us all. In the midst of crisis, we have stood together not only for ourselves, but also the communities that we serve. This is what makes the National Bar Association so special. As we enter into a new year, I wanna wish each of you and your families happiness, success, prosperity, and good health. And on behalf of all the Calhouns from Texas to Mississippi, I wanna wish each of you a very Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year, and happy holidays to you. Take care. Greetings from the great state of New York. Our NBA family is spectacular because of the beautiful people that make up our membership. The lawyers, the judges, and our law students, all who bind together in an association of the most talented and gifted legal minds in the country. What makes us even more special is not only does this association give us both professional and personal gratification, but we get to make a lasting and substantial impact on the advancement of our communities. Happy holidays from the National Bar Association. Greetings, National Bar Association family. I'm Ashley Upkins, your current secretary. During this special time of year, I just wanted to say that I love my NBA family. Despite the obstacles that we faced this year, we stayed the course. We worked on issues from police brutality to election protection, the pandemic, and even the digital divide. Although I miss seeing all of my NBA family in person, I know that you're fervently working, and I thank you. 
Happy Holidays from the National Bar Association. As we now come to the close of year 2020, I'd like to thank you on behalf of the staff and volunteers of the National Bar Association. Thank you for your dedication and your steadfast commitment to excellence in the practice of law and to equal justice for all. The National Bar Association is the social conscience of the legal profession. The NBA matters because black lawyers matter. So thank you for all of what you did in the past year. Now as we move into a new year, we wish you favor and success. So as I like to say it, may God's grace, may his mercy and his favor shine upon you in all of what you do. So be safe and happy new year. Hello, my name is David Green and I have the honor of serving as a general counsel for the National Bar Association. I love the National Bar Association because as a dynamic group, we kneel for justice, but we stand up to fight voter suppression, police brutality, and COVID-19. Happy holidays from the National Bar Association. I am Akua Kavik, and I'm honored to serve as the National Bar Association's Chief of Staff. I love the National Bar Association because of our extraordinary talent. From our energetic law students, to our exceptional young lawyers, our skilled seasoned attorneys, and the wisdom of our judges. We are home to the best and brightest legal minds our communities have to offer. From the leadership team of the National Bar Association, Happy Holidays and Seasons Greetings. Hi, I'm Carlos Moore, President-Elect of the National Bar Association. I love the National Bar Association because of its mission, its purpose, its stored history, and most of all, because of its members who are like family to me. Happy Holidays, National Bar Association. To my National Bar Association family, during this holiday season, as we gather together with friends and family, I just wanted to take a moment to say thank you. Thank you for allowing me to lead this magnificent and majestic organization during this time of crisis in our country, where we have three pandemics, COVID-19, election suppression, and police brutality. My goodness, ladies and gentlemen, we have had so much we've had to deal with. But the one thing that's been a constant is the National Bar Association has stepped up to the plate just as a baseball player would step up to the plate, take a bat and knock it out of the ballpark. That's what we have done at the National Bar Association. That's what you all have done. And it's been a very, very, very eventful six months. I want to thank so many people because only at the National Bar Association would you have an incredible chief of staff like Akula Kaufman. She is everywhere, organized so much, kept us on track, kept us on task, kept me on task day in and day out, and I owe a debt of gratitude to her, to the incredible general counsel of the National Bar Association, who has kept us where we need to be with his opinions and his team, David Green. He is a lawyer's lawyer. He is so extraordinary, and we just have to thank him in this holiday season. Thank him for all that he's done. To have the chairs of, of our task force, election protection, Leslie Fields out of Washington, D.C., and our president, like Carlos Moore out of Mississippi, and Tanya Clayhouse, Barbara Arnwine, leading our effort in the election protection movement during the presidential election. Over 7,000, ladies and gentlemen, we, we said we were going to do it, and we did it. We had over 7,000 lawyers out there fighting and fight, poised for litigation if needed, and on the hotlines and doing everything that we needed to do and committed to do. And to our young lawyer chair, Nika Williams, who mobilized those incredible young lawyers, we say thank you. To the Police Brutality Task Force, who have tackled that issue, Clarence Williams, Daryl Parks, and to our soldiers in the field every day representing the least of these in this country and their families, the families, Breonna Taylor, George Floyd. So we see Vice President Lonita Baker, Ben Crump, Lee Merrick, Chris Stewart, and not to mention, of course, Daryl Parks, and so many others, we say thank you. And to our COVID task force. So with COVID, we have been there as a National Bar Association for our communities. Marlon Primes, Karen Evans, Laverne Aunt Largie, incredible work. You see those NBA masks throughout the country 
dispersed. We've got computers in disadvantaged communities so that children can learn and so much more. And ladies and gentlemen, only at the National Park would we have a past president, Fred Crane. And we're only at the National Park, I would have the unbelievable pleasure, one of the most incredible experiences in my professional career of being cohort counsel to represent the over 197,000 Georgians who were improperly and illegally stricken from the rolls. To have Fred Gray at our side, on our team, a team led by National Bar Association lawyers, is, ladies and gentlemen, where we need to be, front center, leading the charge of social justice in this country. So I say to some of my close advisors, Arthenia Joyner, I say to past president Arthenia Joyner, thank you. To past president H.T. Smith, thank you. To past president Kim Keenan, thank you. To past president of so many of you past presidents who have been there by my side, Ben Crum, Gerald Parks, and to Yolanda Cash Jackson, who was the person who orchestrated and ensured that Vice President-elect Kamala Harris, she ensured and organized that, that extraordinary event where she spoke to our membership. That was so memorable and too. So Yolanda, I want to say thank you to the thousands of others of you who have been in the trenches and worked with me tirelessly. I want to say thank you because there's one thing that we know that we're doing this the National Bar way. And only at the National Bar can you have extraordinary leadership, past leadership, converge and come together to ensure the future of our organization. So in this holiday season, I want to say thank you. I want to say there's no better way than the NBA. And I want to say that we're going to keep on keeping on. And the next six months, we're going to continue to take our organization to the next level because we're interested in that legacy. So that whenever people hear NBA, they don't think of National Basketball Association. They think of those talented trailblazing lawyers that comprise our National Bar Association. Thank you and happy holidays. Hang all in this mistletoe, I'm gonna get to know you better. This Christmas and as we trim the tree, how much fun it's gonna be together This Christmas the fireside is blazing bright